Click juice. Make this beat. What's up, guys? It's your girl Tati back with another banger video. And today, I'm going to be doing a clean with me video. So you guys are gonna be here and watch me clean all of my nail products up because I've been doing a lot of nails so I haven't got a chance to clean up my stuff and organize it. So as you guys know, you guys cannot see me but a little bit of me because I'm going to be showing you guys mostly of what I'm doing. So I'm going to be cleaning up all my stuff and you guys are going to watch me clean my stuff. I know I haven't been doing the videos in a while. Um, I've been sidetracked it by a lot of things. I've been doing nails, having clients. If you guys haven't followed my nail page, go follow my nail page. It will be right here, and it will be in the description below box for you guys to go follow my nail page and um, see some nails that I've did. I've been doing a pretty good job. I'm improving, and I love it, and it's actually a fun and exciting experience to do. So I tell a lot of people to invest in doing nails, invest in doing anything you like to do, just invest I feel like anybody should invest in what they really want to do um, doing nails is pretty fun and it's kind of challenging depending on what you're doing but you'll get over it you'll get into it so like I said this is gonna be a clean with me video and make sure you guys follow me on my nail page it will be in the description below box Make sure you guys give this video a big thumbs up. I will be back to posting more videos. I will be doing another Q&A with my boyfriend probably after this video once I upload this one. And I will be doing a new Q&A, an updated Q&A. As you guys know, some of you guys know, some of you guys don't know, we actually turned a year on the 11th of September. And we had a pretty good time and it was really fun. So yeah, and as you guys know, I did not record that day. But if you follow me on Instagram... You seen like you know our pictures and what we had on what I was wearing just simple things like that but I'm not gonna make this intro too long I know I've been gone for a while so I know you guys miss me and I miss you guys too and I will be back doing more videos for you guys so without further ado make sure you guys follow me on all social medias um, follow my nail page and my Instagram page my snapchat all that will be in the description below box my email will be in the description below box in the description below box for um, business things and stuff like that and yeah so let's get into this video right now okay guys so throughout the video I will be showing you guys some stuff that I have even though um, I have a nail video up but there's some stuff that I got that my mom purchased for me and got stuff for me to help put my stuff in so I have a couple things so this thing right here is full of stuff like even this I gotta throw it away it's like so much stuff that I got in here hand files that should be thrown away and everything this is a little basket so I'm gonna organize this and it's gonna look way better than this and I'm showing you guys before so. wow but before and I'll show you guys after so I'm gonna just start cleaning up everything and getting everything organized right now so I'm gonna start by first. I'm gonna start by cleaning off all of my um my polishes. And I'm gonna clean them all off. And these are regular polish, and I have gel polish as well. So I'm gonna start by cleaning all of these off with alcohol wipes. I'm gonna just clean everything down, and I'm gonna put them back. I'm gonna put them back into the little thing that um my mom purchased for me. So as you guys see, it's kind of wet, and I cleaned it off. And I just sit all my polishes in here. So I use regular polish and I have gel polish. Um, I sit most of my regular polishes in here because my gel polishes are really small. So they're like baby. So I just usually leave them in the box that they came in. So yeah, so I'm gonna just wipe this down and I'm gonna fix up all my polishes and put them all back in here and organize them. So let's get it. Make this beat. Okay, so as 
actually change the angle of the camera so you guys can actually see how it looks. So, I'll just hit this right here. Just make sure you guys can see that right. So I'm organize all of these ones and put them at the top. Alcohol wipes to clean off all of the polishes. Make this beat. Okay, now that I'm done with all the regular polish and some of these are like gel light colors but they're still like regular polish um, I do these first I wipe them down um, now I'm about to get to like my top coat my base coats my nail preps primers cuticle oil stuff like that I put on the first row because that's the first thing that I um, start off with so I'm gonna do that so this is my base coat this is a base coat that I use for like gel. If you're getting like a um, gel manicure, I put this on your natural nail first as a base. This one is my top coat. So this one is my top coat. Which I have, you know, two base, oops, two base, two top coats. So yeah. My cuticle oil, this is the one I use towards the end. This is my primer I get from a local um, beauty supply store. It's just a little regular primer for the nails. This is from Mia Secret. This is the nail dehydrator, nail prep. And I'm gonna make a base, other base coat somewhere. And this one is from Amazon as well, and it comes with my gel coats. I mean my gel coats. My gel polishes, this one comes with it. It comes with the top coat as well, but this one is the matte. The matte top coat. I don't know if you guys could see that. Okay, there you go. So this is my matte top coat for my gel polish. Okay, so that's it for this little part right here. Um, it looks kind of blurry. Okay, there. This is it for all of my regular polishes. This is all my polishes, my top coat. This is the main things I use is right here. These are the main products I use for the nails, the cuticle oil towards the end when they're done. I run the cuticles to be shiny. The nail prep and dehydrator is the same thing in one. You put on your nail, dehydrate your nail. The primer is just to help your nail as well. Put the primer on. And the rest of this is the regular polishes, top coat and base coat. So let's get to Okay hey guys, so right now I'm about to go ahead and clean this little basket out, which I took some stuff out already, but I'm about to clean this out right now. So all the dirty hand files, 
I just throw them right in the trash. So dump all your dirty files in the trash. So now I'm going to just put all your dirty buffers too. All of that. Oh, wait. So I have new ones. So what I'm going to do is I leave it right here in this side. I don't know if you guys can see it. It looks kind of blurry. but let's see. It looks blurry and then it looks dark. Wait, let me see. And usually I don't really put all my stuff in the room. I put it in here so it won't be in, a, in my mom's living room because that's where I do nails at is in the living room on that on my table. And I have like my light and everything in there but to stay organized and not keep everything in my mom's living room like everywhere. I just bring it right back in here and just organize it which I haven't organized it in a while because I actually had a client like yesterday or day before that um, I did some nails. So that's why all my stuff was in there and now it's back coming in my room. And so I have another client. So yeah. These are like my butterflies, diamonds, diamonds, and more diamonds. So I'm just saying. I put all my drill bits in this box and I actually labeled them my drill bits. This is all my little products I use on nails. And what I do is when I use a client, I usually keep the old drill bit on. So when I get another client, I change my drill bit in front of them. So I usually leave it on there. But I'll take it off right now since I'm like actually deep cleaning. So I'm going to take it out. So it looks like this after you take the sanding band off of it. So it looks. Now, I think I told you guys and I showed you guys already my um, drill bits. This is so cute. I don't know if you guys can really see it, but it's like really pretty type, like holographic and everything. Like my nails. And I, my mom did my nails, but I actually cut them down. And I like them. They're really pretty. Like that chrome powder. So, drill bit. And I usually leave them where I can find them. So I'll sit on that right here. Make this baskets with other stuff in it. I have other like powders, like my glitter powders, purple glitter. My drill bits. I mean not drill bits, standing down. I gotta wipe them down with alcohol. So this is all the stuff I use. This is my brush. I use nail clippers, different nail clippers. I use this to make drip effects. Um, I have other little testy things out where you guys can see. So this one I did was a um, matte color. So it's just like matte, which it should be on this, and I will be putting it on there. Um, Drill. Drill. Kind of decorated it. But yeah. Different stuff. Cuticle. Another cuticle oil. Just different little things. Um, cuticle pusher. 
just different little things I have in here. My um thing to pick up the rhinestones, the rhinestone picker, um, and a lot of other things. So I use all my stuff and I put it in here. These are my old fingers that I did before. So I'll just set them up here beside these. They're like a money sign. It looks like a two, but actually does look like a two, but I, it's supposed to be a money sign. Wait, can I see this? Okay, so it looks like a two, but yeah. This one. A lot of people always like this design that I did. I don't know if you guys can see this. Make this beat. Okay, guys, so this is the end of the video, and um. This is how it came out. I will have a video um, in this to show you guys how it came out. I actually just put my earrings right here. But this is how it um, came out. And I just, you know, set up everything just neatly where it don't look all a mess and everything. Um, I have all my other stuff down here in the little baskets and my acrylics and glitter acrylics over there. This is my thing full of my polishes. My other gel polishes are actually like down here in the bottom. You can't really see it. Um, this is the basket, my little um, swatches. Well, not swatches, but like the colors and acrylic. Okay, so this is the colors I have right here. These are all the colors. I just got it hanging off right here. Um, I have everything I use, my materials. This thing is full of my glues. Um, some little baskets with my um, Mia Secret colors in them. Some of my... Um, buffers in the back i got my liquid over here in the bag um some cotton swabs to like clean around the um the area of this like polish um i got some more monomer in the back i got my white powder i got my clear powder right here some of my um dusting brushes my um practice hands all of my rhinestones butterflies everything right here my practice hands are up here at the top i don't know you guys can see it but it's right here so i put them at the top um and i think that's it for this video yeah i think that's it and this is everything that i organized and put up everything neatly where i can just go straight to it so yeah if you guys like this video give this video a big thumbs up make sure you guys stay tuned for more videos for me i will be doing a q a soon right after this video will be uploaded i'll be doing a q a so stay tuned for that make sure you guys follow my nail page it will be in the description below box to go check out some nails i have done i've done about 20 something nails or 30 i don't remember but yeah go check out my page and see what i did see my crafts period but yeah so i am done showing you guys this video 
everything's neatly done so yeah stay tuned for more videos tati's life or no life period bye guys